that is the goal for today. More antlers, but we need these to do that. So for today's YouTube oh, video, if you will, we've been obviously hammering some scouting because it is the off season and that's important. And today I kind of wanted to go over my favorite boot or whatever, and that would be these Keen Duran 2s. Um, these are like a hiker style boot, a little bit better. Uh, they are on Amazon or the Keen website for like 195. You could generally find them though at a good sale price around the 150 mark. And actually this is my second pair of these. And so I, I just, it was funny, Dave told me, he goes, if you find a boot you like so much, just buy this, you know, buy another one. Um, when it was time to re-up for boots. These are a season old, probably have close to 200 miles on them. Actually, they look super good. You know, they're not as stiff as say like a Solomon boot. I've got a Solomon GTX that, that I also have a, about 200 miles on. And my last pair probably lasted me close to 400 miles before like the, the stitching just busted out the side. And you know, boots are obviously something that is all about what your foot feels and what you look for. But uh, these are definitely my favorite and I like a less stiff boot, I think for tree stand hunting so I can kind of feel that platform a little better. Now, I will say if I'm gonna go pound miles or maybe for, for an elk trip uh, this season, I'll look at just a slightly stiffer boot. Uh, these have a lot of toe room, actually, which is awesome. I had a pair of boots one time that, in, you know, once I wore for about four or five hours, my feet would swell up and they were too tight. Uh, but these have a lot of toe room. I use these from everything from like shoveling the driveway, summer scouting, winter scouting. I will say the only thing I would add is an aftermarket insole. All boots essentially come with like a cardboard insole. And so I, I take something that, that's about, oh, these are like $30. Um, and it's real common, I guess, in the hiker community to, to add inserts to a boot. Um, but the Keen Duran 2, like I said, a, a good oh, hiker athletic style boot. Uh, these, obviously the tread is still solid on these. And uh, I definitely would recommend them. Uh, for anybody getting into them. The, the toe really holds up really well in these boots. I know that's a, a they put like some extra oh, rubberized sole-ish or whatever, but bottom line, it holds up really well. In fact, the, where I see the weak point is, is here on the side. And then um, the only other area they struggle when, if you're gonna do a lot of side hilling, like let's say I'm gonna go pound shed miles for you know seven miles or something in a day, I think I'll throw on the Solomons just because they are a little stiffer. So it, it supports the side hill just a touch better. But if I have one boot to buy, these are 100% them. These are by far my favorite and, and last, uh, you know, you can get a couple years out of them depending on the miles you put on in a year. Thanks for watching. Oh, look what just came in. We'll definitely be looking at doing some videos with the XOP saddle platform soon. All right, let's go scouting. Pro tip of the day, don't get your truck stuck like Mr. Greg Tubbs. Now I gotta call Dave to get him out here.